not everything is bad in Myanmar. There is a couple of good things and it's about that that I'm going to talk in this video. Don't think about Facebook or VPN. If you are like me, you are probably just wasting your time there. So just don't use VPN. One of the things that really surprised me is the clothes. Yes, I know that's the really simplest thing, but it's something you have to think when you want to travel. There is a couple of things that surprised me in Myanmar, especially the second one when you're coming from the West. But the plugs are really incredible. You see, when I come from UK, I didn't know exactly what to expect. I searched online on Google and I found out that there is three different types here. So I was still confused. Someone said, don't worry. I still worry, but I worry a little bit less. And uh, I still I brought my adapters just to find out that I would not need any adapter because it's like three in one or just 10 in one. You can fit probably everything in the same socket. There is only one type that I've seen that you cannot fit in there, which is the free circle big ones, at least larger than the normal. And that is really nice. Got me thinking, what if everywhere in the world was like that? You would not have to worry about adapters. Or at least on the hotels, it would be nice not to need an adapter every time you travel or not need to rush to buy an adapter because your phone is dying. Anyway, that's something that really impressed me. But it's not just in Myanmar, but also in Thailand. I don't really know if in any other place in Asia have the same system. If you know it, let me know down below. And the second thing, YouTube Premium. When I came here for the first time, YouTube showed me this message many times saying that in this region, I may not be able to use my premium benefits. I could be showing ads and etc. So I just canceled the subscription. And when I canceled the subscription, I found out that Myanmar is already premium. What? What? So basically, Myanmar is premium already. I've never seen an ad in this country since I arrived, unless when I was using VPN. Because literally, when you are using VPN, you are not really here, you are somewhere else. Technically, you are connected somewhere else. <laughs> anyway, I don't recommend anyone to use it anymore because it's illegal. So yeah, going back to Facebook, that's amazing. I don't have any ads. I can download basically any video and watch it anywhere when I'm offline. Basically, that's why I wanted the premium, to download as many videos as I could so I can watch them anywhere I go. And having this for free is great, especially because YouTube is the app that I use the most. And thankfully, you don't need VPN to use it. What else is great in Myanmar? If you know anything, let me know down below. You probably already know I'm leaving in Yangon and I'm going to be here for a bit. And if you want to watch more, you know what to do. My experiences living in Myanmar or my first impression since I arrived in Myanmar. Thank you for watching. See you on the next one. I don't know how to win this video. Uh, like and subscribe. <laughs>